Every morning at 6 a.m. I write down how many followers on TikTok I have. I've been doing this since November 1st, 2022 when I started my TikTok account. When I take my followers and I put them on a graph, it looks like this. And I've been able to see every little change I made that led to every increase in followers. I had a big lesson here that led to a big increase. Another one here. And then two over here. This is January 2022 and I learned about the power of hooks. A good hook with average content will do way better than an average hook with good content. This is April 2023 and I learned about trending topics. If you use trending topics, this is called news jacking. Your videos can do better. I started talking about the Silicon Valley bank collapse and I made the most viewed video in the world on the topic. Then I stagnated. Look at this. Oh my God, it was so painful. And then over here, I learned two very important lessons. The first is I automated my editing workflow. I started using a tool called Descript, which allows me to make complex videos like this one. I can go on rants, I can talk, and then with AI, I can remove all the unnecessary things. Things. And I can remove them in one, two, three seconds. It's just a few clicks. And then the last thing I did is I focused more on giving value to my viewers. Rather than tech news and platitudes, I started focusing exclusively on founder stories, hacks, and new marketing discoveries I was making. Michael Bloomberg said it best, to succeed, you must string together many small incremental advances rather than count on hitting the lottery jackpot once. Lesson one, hooks. Lesson two, using trending topics. Lessons three and four, automating my editing workflow and giving value.